Hey you guys, back again, and today guys, it's a random one guys, something different, not a lot too long of gameplay, I just wanted to show people what's in the uh, battle pass guys, in case people are interested or not interested, uh, I can see guys, I've already bought one of the DLCs guys, couldn't help it, it looked absolutely dope, the game's just come out, so I'm going to be using this skin for a very long time guys, looks fucking awesome. Uh, was 3,000 COD points, guys. I didn't obviously pay that because I already had some COD points. Um, and I got more because I ended up buying the um, Black Cell, guys. That's the most part, dangerous part for me. So I bought the Black Cell, guys, so I'm ahead on that. But then I bought this character up for free, pretty much. I had to buy the Black Cell. So, yeah, hopefully I can get some of the money back, though, from, you know, doing the Battle Pass. But anyway, let's get into, guys, showing you the Battle Pass. So if we go back on ourselves, this is your instant rewards, guys. You obviously get... These with the black cell, whatnot, you know, you get the fancy guns not with the black cell, you have her in orange. People probably keep it up, we're probably gonna be fast here, guys. I do apologize, I've gone fast, but I will get through, guys. I will try and do just um, a bot mode with just myself to show you the new map as well. That's really cool. I think it's a sticker, guys, or something. There is some really cool shit. Uh, for the first, you know, go, really, like I said, the black cell stuff, guys, is all on fire. And you got some really cool like shit with it. To be honest, I think it's better than the diamond packets and stuff because you know people are using diamond ore and everything, and the fact of how that a lot of people got it. And I also like that guys you can see, and they're now showing you like the moves and stuff, and you just instead of you just like wondering what it does, they're now showing you. So that's pretty cool. But as you can see, guys, I'm going to break quick because obviously I'm doing a normal recording on this, and I only have like 60 minutes, and I don't know how long it's going to take me to get into a normal round because most people already guys are seeing the new that's a new gun by the way yeah and i'm using the new gun with the new character guys so if you buy the new character for three thousand you will get that like i said you know me guys i'm anti fucking online digital shit but couldn't help it guys they drew me in i saw the character for that's better than anything out there i want to be that even though they don't let you be it on both sides of the fucking game even though i paid for it you can only be it on the Black Ops side of it. If you try and do it on the Crimson side, it won't let you. So, stupid guys, I know. You'll see you get a really cool character, which I'll show you also, guys. That's a really cool looking gun, i got to admit. Hate the gun, though. I think it's the one that fires shit, like, one bullet at a time. So, whatever. So, yeah, it came live, guys, at 2 o'clock. That's also really cool. But, the, um, obviously, the other version, which I have, is fire. But I'm not going to lie, that version looks fucking dope as well so not gonna complain there just scope guys really cool looking handgun and uh, again another like sticker again another fucking sticker got another new gun we get to it the crag c so awesome stuff like i said it might not be for everybody so you know take that in consideration people ain't gonna be bothered as you see now we've got a new emote so if you make it to the end board you can now do that pretty cool like i said guys for the first season i'm not too uh you know shabbled out by it, what the people will say you know oh, i quite know that looks really cool on the gun i got me i can't tell what that put that on my gun but by by all means guys let me know down below what you think is it worth it do you think it's crap do you think this season pass is not worth it i actually think it's quite good personally i think it's all right um no complaints from myself There we go, we've got another um, death sequence, you know. The RC car's got a new skin. So we've got another emote. What does this one do? <laughs> I have no idea what that one's going to be about, but okay. Again, going for that like shiny look on the gun. So I, I'm a fan of that, you know. Shiny guns look cool. You know, it doesn't make you shoot any better, but it, you know, they look cool at least. I'm going to get some CP points here, guys. Now, I do have a 20 skipped here to go on with it, guys. But I'll save them for, like, nearer the end. When I can guarantee I'll be getting burned from doing it. But, like I said, I won't get a of gameplay. I've already put one up today, guys. I just want to show you what's in the season pass for people that don't know yet. Or, you know, people should know by now. But maybe you haven't picked up the game yet. You're wondering if you should wait till season pass one or something. Now, you can see what you get. Like I said, I mean, is it brilliant? 
probably not brilliant, but it's definitely not bad either. In my opinion. But yeah, the new map came up, guys. I've done it once, and then obviously they all was like voting against it again. It's like, why do they do that? It's a new map. Let's play it. Let's try it out. They don't want to, though. They want to do something else or not do that one. What is this? Uh, okay. You know people are going to be using that in a moment. <laughs> I've got me, even I won't use that. It looks funny. Really cool stuff. Oh, that's different. I like that one as well. So, like I said, it's not too bad. Not too bad on the old front. And then obviously, this is the last thing once you've completed it. What is that? A bubble gum? Wonderful. Yep. We get obviously the last character in Black Cell. If you've not got Black Cell, she just looks like. Nah, I should have probably showed everyone what the difference was, but that doesn't really matter. So, yeah, then if you go to the store, guys, you can see we've got some new characters. We've got this bloke here, looks like half parasite, whatnot. He's only 2,400. Uh, I say only because, like, you know, I've had bitched about it in the past, guys. That is fucking still expensive. There's a couple of other ones on here if you want to get any, like, the littler ones. Uh, you can view the bundles, see what you're getting them. So, new character and. Well, new skin, I should say. And they actually show now. Oh, that's a pretty cool murder uh, sequence, though. In fact, he falls onto the axe. I like it. See, that's what I'm talking about. It made it better, though. I wish they dropped the price a tad, you know? So, then you get this character here. Oh, that's pretty funny. It's good that they're actually giving you emotes, you know, so you can actually use them and never have their own unique ending rather than everyone keep just whistling and fucking putting a thumb up and pushing it down, you know? It's pretty cool to get some new emotes. What's this one do? Takes out a head and pats it. <laughs> yeah, I won't lie, that one's, easy. That one's pretty cool. Glitches afterwards and sits on top of her face after that, but other than that, yeah, really cool. And there's another couple more here. So, not bad, not bad overall, not bad. Right, let's see if I can get into a private match. Um, create a private match. I don't give a shit about, you know, what I'm supposed to be doing any right minute. I've got to invite a player. I don't want to invite a player. Well, I'm in the game, but okay. What I'm going to do now is obviously... No, I want to sort out. It's starting the bloody round. Hang on a minute, guys. I am fucking this up. I want to change the bloody map. Try that again, guys. Create your fucking match. Wait till it puts me in the match. Game set up. Try that. Fucking hell. Come on, still put me in the round. All right, now I'm in the round. I can do some game set up. Right, here we go. So, I believe the new map, guys, that's Warhead, which I thought was new, but apparently it's not. The wife said she did it yesterday, so it's this one, guys, Extraction. So, this is the new map, from what I gather, anyway. We'll just go into it, there's nobody there, but obviously myself, so let's play. Like I said, the whole base of this is just so we can see the map and look at it without... Getting killed multiple times and so on and so forth. So after this, I'll end the gameplay. Just basically to show people what there is this month. I thought I'd do something different, guys. You know, people might hate this video. You might not, guys. It might be something that people want to see. So at the end, I'm just doing it for something different, guys. I haven't picked my new gun. I should have got my new gun, guys, because that is really cool. I'll show you that in another video. Well, I might have enough time to show you in this video, guys, but... We've got 10 minutes to look at the map, guys. So as you can see, it's a big open, like, lobby here. And then, like, you've got these desks where people will probably are hiding, no doubt. You can't go anywhere over here. You, know, you can't go out there. As far as I'm aware, you can only go out them doors, through there, and through here. So we're going to go through here. I'll try and speed run it a little bit, because obviously this, we've got 10 minutes to look around. You can't go back there or nothing, but you can go up this ladder. And, you know, look into there where people will be. They'll also see the ladder there, which takes you around and around to some stairs, which I'll get to. Obviously, if you come out them doors, you come out over here. And then 
you've got another ladder there which can you obviously go up and look at people coming around here and so forth and whatnot and then you've got the in part where you can go to the double door straight out to the other side or up here which i haven't done yet guys i don't know what's up here ah okay that's the watchtower sort of thing so again you could get to see who's in there and running around here or who's going to be down there and whatnot because you can go down there you could choose to go down this area or just go around the side here down the slope either way you end up here so this week you see the water and shit which is really really cool i think you can get up here yes you can and which i think you can get up there which you can just in case you want to know then you go through the double doors Again, two ways in. We've got a little island here to go wait a minute, you can go up some stairs as well. That just puts you back up there. Okay. And then through here, you can see the sea and shit. Really, really cool. Nice looking. No complaints from me, you guys. Looks fucking amazing. Really like the map. Oh yeah, you can go up here as well. Which then obviously you can go up here or into there. But for this purpose of this we'll go around a long way. But obviously you can go through the door. Back into here again, and uh, most people are going around here through the building or up here. Again, just something to look at. You can't go down there. Into here, up the stairs, like I said. There's the bit I showed you a minute ago. Up here, here's the stairs where I was stood over there, guys. That's the whole map, guys. That's the whole map. Like I said, I got no complaints from it. It's actually a cool, pretty cool map. I like it. You know, I also look at map where it's really bright and lit up. It's really bright and lit up. You know, you can see where people are running to. It's a good map to, you know, you hide, just run, shoot, and go. You, know, you can hide here, sort of thing, shoot around a corner, go in the building. It's good. It's good. It makes it for a good map. I think it's going to be good on Search Destroy. I think it'll be good on Control. I think it's just an overall good map. They put some effort in, guys. You actually get on the helicopter as well, you know, hide in here if you want to. There'll be a lot of people doing that at some point. Snipering and whatnot, guys. So, yeah, that's the uh, new map. Anyway, you can get the bus, guys. So hopefully I didn't miss nothing out on the map, guys. But that is the map. I'm now going to quickly leave so I can get my new gun and show you that, guys. Because I really like one feature about this gun. And I want to quickly show it. I can even do my own emotes, guys. You can go test them here if you want to test them here. Pretty cool, pretty cool. But I'll just show you one more thing, guys, and I'll end the gameplay there because it's not really more. But it's one of the characters you get from the uh, Black Cell Pass, which I really do like. And then with her as well, you get a variant. Also, you get the Fire variant. For now, you get the last variant when you beat the game. But this is the character, guys, you've got to be if you want to be the new character I just bought. So I will be her, and I will go weapons and get my new weapon to show. So that is this brand new SMG. And it's right here. I have got a secondary weapon as well, so I could even show that. I believe it's one of these. No, it's an assault rifle, I believe. No. It's looking for it, guys. Yeah, I think it's this one. No, nope, that's the fire the one, not the boiling point one. That's an instant reward. So it might not be an S. Don't do Maybe it's a. We're getting asked about the tip. Is it that? No, nope, that's the. Which one is it, guys? Which one is it? In that. It is that. It's a shotgun, guys. Right, we'll try them both out. I haven't seen the secondary gun anyway. Um, we'll have a look. Don't matter about the same map. We'll just go in. I'll just want to show you some of the features this gun can do. Because I thought it was really cool, guys. And that's what I'm talking about. We're getting new things with the um, DLC. That's that actually kind of makes it a little bit more worth the buy. Well, it doesn't. But I thought it was uh, really cool. And I had to get it, guys. I want to have eight special characters in the game. And... I always buy at least one. Sometimes I buy more. It depends if I'm really, like, really drawn in, guys. I've got to admit, this one was a fishing hook for me, and I I took it, guys. So we'll go outside and then get him better lighting. So what's this gun do, though? Let's have a good one. So this is the shotgun they gear. Pretty cool. It's tracer bullets. Probably turns into dust like the other one does, but really like it. I don't know if this does anything where I do this with this one. 
not by the looks of things, just a similar thing to the normal. But this one, guys, when you do this with this, sprays fire out of it, guys. Like, how fucking dope is that? Well, I thought it was. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know I did that as well, though. More fire. Love it. Bit of a long sequence in that time. You'd have been shot 50 times, but I love it. And, you know, you've got tracer bullets again. I'm getting a bit of blade lag, guys. Tracer bullets and then off. You know, it's really green and fast firing. So, yeah, look, this is the new machine gun anyway. So, if you do buy this character, you unlock that machine gun instantly. And you'll be leveling it up with this character anyway. So, yeah, hopefully, guys, that's answered some questions. If anyone wants to know what you get in Season 1 or whatnot, if you're not playing yet or you're thinking about buying the game, that's what you get, guys. So, worth it. Like I said, Black Cell is still 25, so on, or what's that. But it's still, I'm excited about it, guys. I'm happy with it. And there's my, uh, just dope. Love it, guys. Love it. On that note, guys, thank you very, very much for watching. I'm going to end it here. I tried to make it as quick as I can, guys, not to make it go on and on and on. So, like I said, thanks very much for watching, guys, and I'll see you all in the next one.